This is Roger with Wheel Kinetics in Tucson, Arizona. We're selling this truck. We're not selling the trailer. The trailer is not for sale, but it's for demonstration purposes. All right. This truck is a 2005 F550, two-wheel drive, six-liter. Uh, it's an XL, uh, but it does have power windows and locks and uh, tilt. It does not have cruise. Okay. Uh, obviously, it's a dual rear wheel. We had a did a little special stuff with the rear end of this thing. I'll show you that in a second. Uh, it was a theft recovery purchased directly from an insurance company in LA. Uh, it has 93,600 miles. Uh, it is on a clear title. Uh, there will be before pictures uh, before it left LA and it looks completely different. It used to be gray. It had primer gray paint. They hit it with the paint. It also had a horrific flatbed with some weird brown something tank on it that's in the trash I'll show you what we did to clean that up and to make it more useful in a second um, we did an inspection on this vehicle this is what it looks like and this is what we did uh, two injectors fuel sender IPR serpentine belts Rotella oil change and filter rear shocks are new obviously the diamond plating on the on top of the frame uh, hitches balls job box etc I'll show you around right now we also obviously painted the cab we sent it to Mako and painted it white again um, it's a nice truck the trailer uh, is full of rocks I'm told there's about 8,000 pounds worth of rock in that trailer and the trailer itself weighs 3,500 pounds and it's still not really enough weight to uh, get the bounce completely gone when you drive this thing without a trailer on it it's you uh, probably need are gonna need medical attention afterwards because there's so much it's real stiff you need something on that suspension if you want to make this your daily driver like a car um, you're gonna be very very upset with that <laughs> it'll kill you you want to start it for me Joe's gonna start it for me and open up the hood there's the window. I'll show you the Carfax in a second. It's kind of funny. Even the Carfax is kind of interesting. We did recover the seat also. It's got a brand new uh, covered seat. So Carfax has accident reported. Vehicle not damaged. How funny is that? When do you see that, right? <laughs> so I have like, oh, I got to read this. This is, this is interesting. So it says, accident involved in Virginia in 2005 rear impact with another motor vehicle vehicle not damaged huh <laughs> so it bumped into something really small and that's probably in the dump and this thing's fine anyway it was reported stolen uh, November of 13 and recovered June of 15 and that's it all right it was a mercury insurance car 93,165 when we bought it we've been driving it we want to make sure that it tows properly and everything so we put about 500 miles on it there you go. There's our title, there's their title, everything. Uh, let's see. There will be a full gallery of pictures in the in our ad. You'll be able to click on a little device, a little magnifying glass, which will allow you to zoom in on anything you see that you want to see better. Here's your job box. It's a brand new job box that we bought from uh, Home Depot. Joey put this little pad around it because it didn't want it rattling like it was. You can put a little uh, electrical tape, kind of buffers a little bit of the noise. This actually, it was actually a pretty quiet ride down the front of the road, so it was good. Here's your tires. Just so you can see what we're pulling here. That's a lot of rock right there, all right? So you got another hitch back here. Here's all your plugs.
driver window, passenger window, door locks. I also brought Joey along because you don't want me pulling 10,000 pounds anywhere. I'll definitely kill somebody. So, there you go. That's an admission that I don't know how to tow much other than a little small ATV trailer. All right, there's your mileage, 93,642. Like I said, we have tilt here, no cruise, but it has power windows and locks. Interesting combo. There you go, radio's working, air's blowing ice cold. You wanna get the web cap off? No? There's a Ford stamp there, so that's an original fender. Battery on this side's new. Battery on this side's new. There's your Ford stamp there. Blow by. Very low blow by. That's excellent. Now we're gonna close the hood and we're gonna go for a ride. So, talk a little bit about this while he's driving. If you come to Tucson to drive it home, which you're welcome to do, obviously it would be a good thing to do, but uh, I would suggest bringing a trailer, because boy, you'll be going uh, 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 all the way down the road. If you don't have a trailer, you're probably gonna have some sort of a whiplash or something, because it feels a lot better with that trailer behind it. Um, <laughs> but if you do come to Tucson to drive it home, you're gonna pay, um, Tax and dock fee. Dock fee is $250. Tax is 2% city sales tax here in Tucson, plus whatever your state tax rate is. So if your state tax rate is 7%, you're gonna pay 9%. Real simple, okay? Um, so, if you uh, pay by wire and ship, all you're gonna pay is the agreed upon price. And once we receive your wire, we will fill in the title with your name or your company's name, probably a company's name. Uh, notarize it, sign it off to you, scan it into your online file, and oh, look at it. that's a good way to start your day. There's a cop right there. Uh, <laughs> so keep this down. Um, into your online file, and we will mail it to you. We will even scan in your on the envelope that we mail it to you in. Um, once you receive the truck, once it ships to you, you'll take the title you got in the mail and the truck, obviously, and go get plates. That's if you want to ship, all right? Deposit's $500. Once you receive your deposit, we have a deal. Until then, it is for sale. So, please make sure you get your deposit in. This is kind of a freak show truck. Um, I think a lot of people are gonna be on it once they find it. It might be fine, hard to find this thing on the internet for a little while. It'll probably take a week or two before somebody finds it. But once they find it, it'll be over, all right? So get your deposit in. Once we get your deposit, we'll put your name in a banner over the truck at wheelkinetics.com and you'll know it's yours. Until then, it's for sale, okay? Um, there's that. Let's see, what else? Uh, blah, blah. Warranty speech. It's a 93,000 mile, 11 year old truck. There is no warranty, okay? This is for big boys or big girls, all right? We're gonna sell it at a price that allows you to have saved a little bit of money through the purchase. If it breaks, go get it fixed. We are not fixing this truck. The people who built it at Ford gave it X amount of miles and X amount of years for a reason. The reason is they didn't know what would happen after that many miles or that many years. If they knew it would be fine, they would have given it a 200,000 mile, 20 year warranty, but they didn't, okay? Uh, and they would have sold it for a lot more money and they would have sold a lot more of them. Um, so, bottom line is, there is some risk, it is used, and the risk is on you now, okay? So if you don't like that, please don't buy anything from us, especially uh, uh, anything used from us, and that's everything we have. Go buy a new one, get this set up, get somebody to customize it like that, I have no idea what you'd pay for that, but go do that. Um, if it gets to you and it needs uh, air conditioning compressor or some, 
switch or control or a radio or an injector or a motor or a transmission or something, go get one. Because we're not buying it. This is tough love. <laughs> it sounds a little harsh. There's nothing wrong with this truck today, but who knows? It could break tomorrow. We don't know. If we knew what everything you know was going to do before we bought it, we would never buy a bad truck and we would never have to spend any money on repairs or anything, right? <laughs> so, you know, that's the reality of it. We don't want people buying stuff that they're not prepared to deal with, okay? And I think that the people who buy this type of vehicle kind of know what they're getting into. We do offer an EGR package where we do the uh, bulletproof EGR cooler, the uh, Ford oil cooler, gaskets, coolant, all that included, and an IPR for $2,400. Um, it's in our ad, it's a smoking deal. Um, we only do that for people who agree to it and pay for it before it delivers. We've been having people who buy them and then two months later they come in and they want this done and it's just backing up our shop because everyone else is doing it for $4,500. That's why they're coming back. So we're going to have to put an end to that or we're never going to get onto our stuff. All right? So if you want that, it's a good price, uh, but you're going to pay for it and you're going to get it done before it leaves our shop. Once you're the owner and you're burning gas, it's going to be a lot more money and you're going to want to probably do it in your town. Okay? Uh, blah, 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 blah. What else? I think that's it. Did I miss anything, Joe? Nope. Okay. Thank you for your time.